Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Fox Tonight. This is Daily Rambles. Today we're going to do Season 1, Episode 4 of Loki called Nexus Event. So, we start off in Asgard and the TVA arrests a young Sylvie. She must have been probably at least like 7 or 8 or something. She was really young and she managed to escape the judge. And then she wants to know why she's been arrested and um she talks to the timekeepers and she's in trouble so um the judge just finds her and just basically banishes her and so she's been on the run and now we cut to her c20 is gone and so sylvie and Lucky talk and they talk about surviving and then we talk to where the tva found them and they got re-arrested then Mobius um, sends Loki to Asgard, and Sif slaps him, hurts him again and again and again and again and again. And it's funnier every single time. And um, basically, Loki every time tries to get her to see reason, and that's just not happening. Then Mobius talks to the judge, and that's a nope to see Sylvie. Then we cut to where the same thing keeps happening to Loki over and over again, and he tries again to apologize, to be nice, but again, Sylvie, Sif is just like, screw you, and still hurts him. <laughs> then we cut to where Mobius talks to him, and basically, Loki took ownership, and Mobius says that Sylvia's gone now. Then Mobius called him out, and basically, he's like, I'm just kidding, she's not gone. And then we cut to where Loki tries to tell the truth, and actually does, which is a shocker, because, you know, he's not really used to doing that. And then, um, Mobius doesn't buy it, then we cut to where the TVA cop believes him and talks to Sylvie, then the judge and Mobius talk some more, and basically the case is closed on Loki, and the tag keepers want to actually see Mobius. Then Mobius is kind of starting to question everything, and because he, um... Because Loki dropped the ball, he's done what he's actually a variant too. He's just been reprogrammed to do the TVA's job. And that's why he has, like, basically an obsession with jet skis. Then, um, we cut to where the judge is protecting him and warns him. Then we cut to where Sylvie and the cop talk, and, um, the cop tells uh, Sylvie to prove it. And she does. Then Mobius is in the library and saw C220's, um, file. Then we got to where Mobius talks to Loki, Loki and now is helping him. Then the judge is waiting for them and Mobius is gone. And we cut to where B-15 is next. Then the judge takes the L uh, Loki and Sylvie want to know her Nexus event. Then she doesn't remember and then she sees so they go see the timekeepers and they called them out. Then B-15 lets them out and there's a huge fight scene. And, um, turns out the timekeepers are not real. They're just animatronic, um, robots. And I was very shook by that. Then B-15, uh, then Lucky has an idea and boards out. Then the judge pruned him. But we found out Loki's actually alive with other Lokis. And that was the end of the episode. It was a crazy episode. I thoroughly enjoyed it so much. I gave it an A+. Plus. It was so good because you think that the timekeepers are real, but they're not. <laughs> we sent that aspect, and I was like, what the hell is happening? It was so cool to watch. I um, love the fight scenes. I love the storyline because we were learning so much about Loki and Sylvie. And I think it's just really interesting to see it play out. So... Really enjoyed the episode, and that's going to do it for this video. So, like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, and um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.